Today, Uganda's Constitutional Court is set to begin high hearing on three petitions challenging the controversial anti-homosexuality law that came into effect in May. This law has been met with widespread international criticism due to its severe penalties for individuals engaged in same-sex acts, including the death penalty for aggravated homosexuality. The term aggravated homosexuality encompasses acts that involve sex with children or vulnerable individuals, forced same-sex relations, contraction of a lifelong infection such as HIV, and cases involving serial offenders. The petitioners, comprising both individuals and human rights organizations, argue that the law was passed without sufficient and meaningful public, par and meaningful public participation and more crucial violates several constitutional rights and freedoms. This law has been widely condemned as draconian, inhuman, and a grave violation of universal human rights. Critics argue that it stifles freedom of expression and association while infringing upon the right to equality and non-discrimination, the right to dignity, privacy, health, and more. A 20-year-old man faced prosecution for aggravated homosexuality in August, marking the first known case under this law and potentially risking the death penalty. Reports have also revealed over 300 human rights abuses this year against LGBTQ plus individuals in Uganda. These abuses range from torture and beatings to arrests and public exposure of individuals based on their sexual orientation and gender identity. كان هو بريمير ولد لعب ودر صاحب كذا هو أدي يوم الكستا كوب يحبي لشة ودر هنا لقاعد صادر ميل والبا كم عمله أكون كذا يكار كذا بريمير بانك لسه ودك ما أنت أو كم عارف كونه هرمري نلاش هذا نقاله بريمير ولد